So, exam 2, project 4, task 1. Okay. So, sa instruction, add open to the quick access toolbar. So, di ba ito yung quick access toolbar natin sa taas? Actually, pinagwato sa inyo sa learn key. Eh. Yung, ang pinilagay naman dito sa inyo sa quick access toolbar is yung na accounting number format. Okay, so dito, i-add lang din natin si open. Okay, so uh, ano bang nakalagay sa quick access toolbar? So, andito yung auto save, yung save, yung undo, and redo. So, i-add natin yung open na command. So, ito, i-click natin yung um, customize quick access toolbar button. And then, i-check lang natin yung open. Ayun, so, ayun na yung command na open. Then, mark completed. Task 2. Add the value, new rates, to the title property of the document. So, yan naman document property. Pag document property ang pinag-uusapan, lagi yung nakay file tab, and then uh, info, and then ito yung properties. So, ang sabi sa instruction, new rates ilagay natin sa title. So, ayan yung title. Add a title. Type natin, new rates. And then, um, back tayo. Yan. So, yun na po yun. Task 2. Mark completed. Task 3. Select, ah, select. Set cells A1 to F11 so they will be the only cells that print. So, ang gagawin lang dito, set mo lang po yung print area ng A1 to F11. So, A1 to F11. Yan. And then, page layout. Page setup group. Set print area. Ah, sa print area, drop down, then set print area. Yan. Then, mark completed. Task 4. Save the rentals worksheet as a CSV, comma, delimited file named rentals.csv to the geometrics templates folder. Isa save po natin itong rentals worksheet as a CSV file. So, file, and then save as, browse, and then, andito na tayo kay Geometrics Templates. Make sure na doon kayo. Pagka wala, pumunta kayo ng Documents. And then, hanapin nyo si, si Geometrics Templates. So, ang pangalan daw ng file is Rentals. Malaking R. <clears throat> Kahit hindi mo na i-type yung CSV, no? So, dito sa Save as Type. Itong Save as Type. Yung Excel Workbook, gagawin nating CSV. CSV, comma, delimited. Meron ditong CSV na UTF-8. Baka mali to kayo. Hindi po yan yun. Ano? And then, meron ditong CSV, delimited. Meron din ditong CSV Macintosh, CSV MSDOS. So, sundin na lang natin nasa instruction. Ito yun. CSV, delimited. And then, save. Again, kahit hindi mo na i-type yung .csv kasi nakalagay na nga siya rito sa save as type. Then, save. Yan. Then, mark completed. Task 5. On the rentals worksheet, configure the heading row so that entries wider than the column wrap to multiple lines. So, asan po ba yung ating um, heading row? So, ito kasi yung uh, heading natin. Uh, ibang term dito is column heading. Ayan. So, ito yung mga heading. Kasi table to eh, no? Pag sinabi mong heading, parang ito yung parang pinaka-title niya. Parang pinaka-heading niya sa taas. Ayan. So, dapat daw i-wrap daw natin ito para yung mga text na lumalagpas or yung tag dito, um, hindi kasha, bumaba yung ibang text na bumaba. So, i-select natin from uh, A2 to F2, buong column heading. And then, home, andun yung wrap text. Ayun, nakalagay sa instruction. Column wrap to multiple lines. So, wrap text. So, ayan ang nangyari is bumaba yung mga text na hindi kasha dun sa cell. So, yun ang mark completed. Great project. <clears throat> the next.